Hey, what's going on guys? So today I'm going to show you guys how to farm money uh, in Nier. So the first thing that you want to try to have is not a requirement, but it's better because your return ratio is a lot better, is to have these weapons here. The more you have, the better. So the machine sword, at least up to level 2 upgrade. Um, there is a machine axe, level 2. As you can see here, when you get level 2, you get a robot discount when you buy items. Um, uh, machine spear and then machine heads and they all give you discount towards the item that we're going to buy here so that's not a requirement but it's way better because you get more money faster this way it's best if you've beaten the game already through through route C so that's three times um, and then you can have chapter select because you kind of want to you need that to bounce around really okay so let's start with that and so let's go and do chapter select. The one you want to select two is chapter four, the tank boss. And you want to do it as 2B. 9S, for some reason, when you uh, load as 9S, you don't get as good of a discount. And I'll show you right now if you load up as 9S. So let's go ahead and load up as 9S. Um, and you'll, I'll show you the price difference. And you, you can only get these items after you've completed the game three times anyway. So you have to beat the game three times okay so on here if you look here note the most expensive items on here so um the gold the black pearl right um that one right there uh and the dictionary so and then also down here right uh the metal uh what you want to do is you want to try to buy as much as possible of these items but as you can see if you play 9s these items they cost way more so look so just just remember these prices 9000 and 4500 are the price right so now you can still do it with 9s but you won't get as much money right so i'm going to load up 2b and we'll we'll compare the prices all right so i have 2b uh loaded up here so let's compare the price and i'll show you uh, why you want to make sure you load up as 2B. As you can see here, it's 1500 cheaper to buy these. And when you sell them, the, the cost when you sell them is the same when you sell them back. So, um, see, 6000 and the other one was 9000 right? So, you're making $3,000 profit per uh, dictionary you'll sell. So, you don't need a lot of money to start, right? Um, I think when I started, I had 50000 or some of that. And then, even before that, I had like 7,000. So buy as much as you can. The other thing is, this is discounted down to 6,000 is because remember how I mentioned in the beginning here that you need these weapons at least upgraded to level two. You don't need them um, necessarily to do this, but it comes down with that discount, the robot discount. So each of those items you get upgraded to at least level two will bring it down. I think standard or just normal price for each one is like, for example, if you buy the dictionary, I think it's like 11,000 or something like that, close to 11,000. So it's still doable, but it's just, it just costs a lot more up front. Um, and your difference when you sell them back, you won't make as much, but you'll still make a ton of money. So the whole, th whole idea is if you don't have a lot of money, you buy what you can. So I max out on this first, right? And then I move on to the next item that's the most expensive. Max out on this, right? And then move on to the next one, max out on this, right? Same thing, right? Max out. Then go down to the last one, max out on this, right? Um, and then this is the next one, right? Because you basically want to use all of your gold. And you're, you're just trying to buy whatever the, the most expensive things are on here, right? So, um, and then the rest is kind of just whatever, right? And the thing is, you don't have to go through all these other ones, right? These other ones are are there. Um, so you're going to be capped, right? I'm just trying to use as much money as I can, pretty much, right? Okay, so I used all my money, right? Now you want to go head back to the TP. You're back here. You have to hit save very important if you don't hit save you kind of just lose uh the items you bought okay and then once you kind of get a ton of money where like you can't spend it all 
Another stop that you can do is at chapter 7 and it's going to be chapter 7 1 here and when you load up you'll be in this village here and what you can do is you can run this way here towards the shop over here and buy the meteor shard in the meteorite so you just keep running over here and these will go for a lot of money as well you'll go here buy you can buy these out here and then you can go and sell them as you can see I have extra funds uh, but that is another stop if you want to make faster money chapter select go down to chapter 15 15 4 9s repair load that up hmm? press and hold the button to skip this the, the, this is gonna the cut there and you can press and hold the button to kind of speed up the text you're healed boom you can all move right. you're all good and then go to the shop here and then you want to sell all those items that you've bought go down to sell go all the way down and um, if you remember we had about a little over two and a half million gil right so um, here are all the items we bought so you're just gonna sell all of them and if you look at the prices here there are a lot more what you're selling back right so you go do that down to the 99s there we go we got crystals mm -hmm. and the thing is you, you can kind of skip all the little ones if you want to uh, the, the ones that are going to make you the the most money is the dictionary right this one remember it cost us six thousand and we're getting eleven thousand back so we just basically doubled our money right there right um And that is it right there. You see that? Just in that one run, we pretty much got 2 million gil off of 2.5 million um, invested there. So that's it, guys. Um, and then all you want to do is run back yes, to here. Don't, I don't skip these texts. Right. God. Mark the next resource recovery unit on the map. Affirmative. And then before you jump and do it again, hit save. That's it. And then you're just gonna re repeat, rinse and repeat until you know you get enough money or how much money you want or need. And that's it. Hope this video helps you guys out. If you guys aren't subscribed yet, make sure you guys are subscribed. And like always, and awesome guys. Peace.